Hello, my friend. Welcome back. This video is going to be how to braid the letter O. If you want to learn how to get this perfect O, please keep watching. And the no there means no. Do not skip my ads so that I can make money. Thank you. So to start off, I start patting out the shape of a zero <laughs> like a, the letter O start carving out the shape it might take you a while you might go from weird shapes and then you just little by little keep carving picking at it adjusting and very soon you will be left with the perfect shape you like the perfect shape to like so I got the shape perfect at first and I was like no I want it to be like the size of the N and I started all over when you are done twist the hair like this so that you can see the edges all around to know if your O is okay or not when, it's, when you're done with that share the letter into two straight sorry the circle the cycle the circle share the circle into two straight in the middle and when braiding we are going to braid towards the outer part of the circle close to the outer line the round curved line while making the inner section like a brush so just pull the hair all the way to the outer part as you braid and continue that way all around it is going to make your letter O look more beautiful I promise you if you do it in the middle at a point it will start looking like zero you know the difference between zero and O I don't know I think one is more oval so we don't want the oval one we want it to be round like absolutely round and gorgeous like mine so when we are done you can do whatever you want no you cannot do whatever you want with the tail because if you do you're going to distort the shape of the o so you have to either sew on the tail onto the braid as you're going to see where i place it place it on itself and sew it with needle and thread or you can use any hair accessory you're using to like clip it together for here you can see i use these hair clamps to like hold the hair together when i got to where i wanted it to stop also you can use a large hoop to just especially if your hair is not too thick if your hair is thick you cannot put it into the large hoop because it will be like a bumpy letter o or like a confused or a drunk letter O like it's just going to be rough and up and down and all over the place but if your hair is not too thick you can use a latch hook to just pull in and if it's not too long you can use a latch hook to enter inter, like to latch in the tail onto the hair but for me I just use these clasps and it's easy to put it's easy to take out it looks beautiful and it's highlights the shape so it's perfect for me remember to send this video to any friend or relation or anyone that has the letter o in their name <laughs> that's shady just send it send it out share this video with your friends and families or anyone that might find it interesting because of course we need as much fun as we can or just something interesting going on in life because we need a share so just share thank you so much for watching i have braided from letter a up to this part and it keeps going up to letter z so check out my channel for more goodies bye baby